uh, hi in this video we will talk about how to handle keyboard actions in playwright okay so for this i created one class called handle keyboard actions test and inside this i created one test ng test called key press actions so sometimes i want to simulate some of the keyboard actions tab or enter control c control v something like that in my automation so how you can perform that in playwright okay so for that let me take one of the websites called so the internet heroku app.com slash key presses so here if you come here so here there is a kind of text box so inside that whenever you say whatever you enter you perform an action on your keyboard so that will be displayed as a text so when i hit enter now i'll hit enter in my keyboard you see that you entered key you enter enter so now i'll enter tab you see tab you see space and then uh, delete okay so i press d s d r so whatever you press it will see means by taking this example we'll we'll do the same thing okay so let me take this url first let me create an instance of page so page page is equals to playwright dot create dot chromium dot new browser type options dot set headless false dot new page so now let me navigate to this url first and then what you need to perform here first i need to find the locator or this element so id is equals to target okay so page dot locator okay page dot locator this is the locator you have to mention hash dot we need to use press and inside this what you want to perform if i want to perform enter simply mention enter okay so first okay i'll put thread dot sleep and then is dot close so now i'll go to here so after this also let me put a sleep for at least 3 seconds to see the execution properly so let me run this and we'll see what is the behavior after 3 seconds you observe so it showed and now went so we'll see by taking other things so thread dot sleep of at least 2 seconds and i'll try to perform tab capital t a b tab and again what i'll do i'll take space space bar okay so for each action i am giving 2 seconds delay to see the execution properly okay so you need to find the locator or you can do one more thing here you can directly use page dot press what is the locator target so we have seen this these things for each and every method in our previous fill and no type all these things the same way here also we can use in both the ways okay so let me run this and observe the behavior uh 
observe carefully so enter 2 seconds tab space so for enter only it is coming and you know it's disappearing but remaining things it's staying there okay so now we see enter tab space the same way if you put capital a or capital a whatever it is it will execute but sometimes i want to or for multiple actions so let's say an example if i go to so demo dot automation testing dot in slash register dot html here i type krishna okay then i want to select this and i want to cut this and i want to paste here in the last name okay is that possible with this playwright you know keyboard actions so that is possible so let me copy this URL. After five seconds, again I'll navigate to this URL. And same way, wait for three seconds. And then, so first, what I'll do, I'll find this element. So, so, so placeholder is equal to first name. Okay. So placeholder is equal to first name. So let me take this. This is the locator. What I'll do, I'll say fill Krishna. Okay. So after that, on the same locator, I want to perform control A first. I want to select. Okay. So select means control A, control X, and then in the other locator, control V. Okay. So what I can do, page dot locator. This is the same locator. dot we need to press what control a right so control plus a okay control a and then on the same locator i want to perform control x i want to cut that so in between i'll put at least two seconds to see what exactly is happening okay and then Again, after this, I'll wait for two more seconds and I'll go to last name and here I need to see control V, paste, control A, select all, control X, cut, control V, paste. Okay. So after this, wait for five seconds. and close the page. So in our this URL will perform this enter tab space all these simple things. But here I'll type something in the first name text box and then I'll select that entire text and I'll cut that. I'll paste in the other text box. So we'll, we'll execute and observe carefully whether it is working fine or not. So enter tab space. Now after five seconds, it will navigate to the other URL. You see it is going there. And observe the first name text box. It will fill Krishna in that first. You see control A selected, control X. You see that in the next text box, directly control V pasted. So that's how so after filling, I have not given the wait time because of that, the moment it filled and it selected. Okay. So rerun and see one more time. So this time you can observe that first it will fill Krishna. After two seconds, it will select that. 
after two, two seconds it will cut and another after two seconds it will control v means paste in the other locator last name text box So it is navigating to the other URL. So observe that. You see that control A after two seconds, control A and then control X and then control V in the next locate. So this is how you can perform keyboard actions in Playrate. So if still you want to learn more on this, go to the official website. And here you can see that keyboard actions in the left side keyboard documentation. And you can see that arrow left, shift, backspace, shift plus key A, shift plus, you see that you can say shift plus key A or shift plus A, both control A, All right? So this is how you can perform this keyboard actions in Playrate. okay? So that's all in this video. Thank you for watching this video. Please like the video and share the video and put your thoughts in the comment section. And do not uh, no, forget to subscribe to the channel for interesting updates. Thank you.